Okay. This is the story of Jose Sanchez Del Rio. Hope you enjoy. Whatever happened to predictability? The milkman, the paper boy, even TV. He was born on March 28, 1913, in Sabayo, Michoacán, Campo, Mexico. He died on February 10, 1928. He attended school in his hometown and later on attended school in Guadalajara, Jalisco. Even in his youth, Jose grew up a holy person. He prayed to God, saying that he wanted to die protecting his faith. Jose was always a good Catholic boy, but he was never able to practice his faith openly because the Mexican government was persecuting Catholics. No one in Mexico was able to practice their faith openly without the fear of being arrested or even killed. Hands up. Get up. Because of this Catholic persecution, many rebels arose to fight for their faith. There were two sides, the Mexican rebels and the government soldiers. The Cristero's battle cry was Viva Cristo Rey! Viva Cristo Rey! Viva Cristo Rey! Jose had to convince his mom to join the army. My mom? Yes, son. I need to join the Cristero's. You can't. Your two brothers are already in there. I have to then. Why? I need to fight for my faith. I need to. And think about it. If I fight for my faith and for what's right, it goes straight to heaven. I need to fight for this. Thank you, Mom. Jose was inspired to join the rebel forces because he wanted to fight for his faith. Instead, Jose joined the rebel army to be a medic. One day, in the midst of battle, Jose was captured. Hey, get up! Jose was captured and tortured because he would not renounce his faith. Ah! The government soldiers cut off Jose's soles of his feet as a form of torture. Ah! Renounce your faith and I'll stop! Ah! Viva Cristo Rey! Ah! Jose was beat and tortured as he walked through the town after the soles of his feet were cut off by the guards. Ah! Hey, keep going! Ah! 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 In the end, Jose never renounced his faith and died a martyr. Going! Ah. 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 Renounce your faith! Viva Cristo Rey! Renounce your faith! Viva Cristo Rey! Renounce your faith! Viva Cristo Rey! Join. Uh, this is how he lived a life for God, by fighting for him. He also served other people as a medic during the wars and risked his life every day to save others. Jose imitated Christ during his torture because he was beaten and killed for his faith just like Jesus was. Jose was a God-centered kid because as he went through his life, he focused on his faith. He he fought for his faith, he died for his faith, even after the soldiers beat him and whipped him and threatened to kill him, he wouldn't give up his faith. He stuck with it through the end. Even when his mother wouldn't let him join the army, he pleaded because he knew he needed to go to heaven. And to get to heaven, he wanted to fight. <laughs> Ability. 
sliding in two gross DMs. <laughs> so I put some ketchup on my feet. Blah, oh. blah. Yeah, yeah, that's hot. Look at that. That's yeah. so nasty. Look, it does look like blood. It does. It looks gross. It's smeared around. Yeah. It smells like gross. Ah! <laughs> Put this on Snapchat too. I'm gonna to do Snapchat. You're gonna put this on Snapchat? Yeah. I'm gonna have the time of my life. Are you on Snapchat? Is deep. on Snapchat? Jose was captured and tortured because he would not renounce his faith. That was so fake. Do it again. Dude, why? That was. Jack, I was gonna say it first and then. I right. thought that's what I was doing, but okay. Jose had to convince his mom to let him join the army. Mom. Oh I need to go join the army. The Castero Wars. They fight for my feet. You can't. Your two brothers are already in the war. I don't want you going to. Well, mom. This would be... I love you, mom! Mom, I love you! Send me. Send me. Send me. Look at that basketball. <laughs> Guadalajara, Jalisco. You know what I can go for right now? What? Some jalapenos. Jalapenos? He was willing to fight and even die for his faith. He even gave up his horse to his general. <laughs>